No, she got it in. Good evening, YouTubers. Welcome back with Turn Up Patricia. Uh, today, the recipe I'll be cooking is some grilled chicken breast, but I'll be cooking on a skillet. So I'll show you guys how you can grill your own chicken from home. And also on the side, I'll be cooking some grilled, um, well, sauteed, steamed rapini. And if you don't know what rapini is, it's a green vegetable, a little bit bitter, just like kale or any other type of green veggie, but it's very, very good for you. So I'll also be doing that as well. So I'm gonna come on over and then show you guys Hey guys, so the ingredients here. So first, um, start with a chicken breast. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna do is butterfly the chicken breast, okay? And so this is how I do it. So there's just a little piece here, which is fine. So you first get where your firm spot is, and you just slightly cut it up just like so. When you open up like that, and then you literally butterfly it so that's how it is and um if you want you can pound it tenderize it more it's totally up to you but i'm gonna leave it just as is so i'm gonna cut about four of these butterfly them and then i'll show you guys the marinade all right guys so now i have the all of the chicken breast butterfly here in a bowl and i want to show you the spices i'm going to use to marinate so i'm going to start with some of course apple cider vinegar then i'm going to be using this garlic roasted spice, lemon pepper, garlic powder, black pepper, salt of course, and then there's um, some olive oil and I'm going to use fresh garlic. So that's the marination that's going to be in the chicken. All right, um, I'm also going to add a little bit of uh, red pepper flakes, that's optional if you'd like, but um, let that set to marinate for a good couple of hours, at least before um, I'm going to be grilling today um, on the skillet, which I have, and if you don't have a skillet, you can definitely um, use a pan as well. So now the chicken breast is all marinated, as you can see. So I'm going to let it sit now for a couple of hours, and then when we get back, I'll show you how to grill the chicken on a skillet. So this is the rapini that I have here. I have it washed and cut all the stems. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna cut it up in very small pieces, shredding with the, with the knife. And um, and what I do with it, I'm gonna show you, is I'm gonna slice um, an onion, some garlic, thyme, and some green onion, scallion. Some people don't know what scallion is, so if you know what scallion is, then some people say green onion. So scallion or green onion. So I have two of those and then one tomato. And then I'll just show you guys on how that works comes along. Now that I'm going to show you the um, process of cooking the rapini. So first you put in the one medium onion sliced, just like so. Then you add in the two scallion chopped and the three minced garlic cloves that I did as well. You're gonna let that saute. So I put some olive oil in the skillet, uh, about three tablespoons of olive oil. And then as well, I'm gonna put in some fresh thyme, okay? So I'm just going to break that up just like so and put that in there. And then while that's all sauteing, just like so, then I'm going to add in the rapini, as you can see. Okay? So the rapini goes in just like so. You can cook rapini the way you like it. I personally love it this way. It's very healthy. So like today, I can say that it's going to be a healthy meal, you know? My 
nice steamed green chicken breast. You know, sometimes some people want to have like no a nice healthy meal, so I'm showing you guys that today. So while that's cooking up, and then you're gonna just saute that around just like so. Get all the onion and everything coated. It doesn't take long at all to cook this. It needs to steam down, of course. Every green do. So also I like to add is one half tomato chop. That is my preference. Okay? And then the spices I put in there are very simple. As you can see, it's shrinking down. So I'm gonna put it down to medium heat now. And what I like to just add in there, to be honest, it's very simple, just some salt. So I'll say one teaspoon of salt. Let that cook just like so. And then I like to add a little bit of white pepper. All spice. And that's it. And I'm gonna let that simmer down for about 10 minutes or so. And then that greens are done. And I'm going to show you guys next on how to grill the chicken breast. Okay, so now the meat's been marinated for a good couple of hours. So now I have here a nice hot skillet ready to grill. If you guys don't have a hot skillet, you guys can use a fry pan or whichever you have. But when you have a skillet, it makes a big difference. Because for me, I live in an apartment. I don't have a barbecue. It just, it really makes a difference on how the chicken comes out. So if you can invest in one, great. Now I'm going to put it just right like that. Want to give it a nice sizzle. Just like so. So I can put about two at a time in the skillet. So let that cook for a few minutes on each side. So I would say about eight to ten minutes on each side. And that's all it needs. And then I'll show you guys on how it looks like when I flip it over. Okay guys, so after ten minutes, I flipped over and this is how, with the skillet, it gives those little, those little lines, like grilling lines, that this one gives. There's also skillets that you can get that can have that, so it works just as fine. So with this, it's perfect. You grill steak, shrimp, kebab, chicken breast, whatever, and it just gives you that grill feel. And um, so this is exactly how it's supposed to look. So now I'm just the other side, and I'm going to put the rest of the back. And then show you guys the end result of this meal for the people. Okay, so now um, chicken's all done. So you can see, nicely grilled. Looks like barbecue chicken, right? So after that, I just kind of glaze on top. I have this sauce called Portugalo barbecue pineapple piri piri sauce. Very nice. It has a sweet and a bit of tanginess to it. And I just brush that on top of there. All right, so now I'm going to show you guys the presentation of the whole entire meal that I made today, and uh, that's it, guys. All right, guys, so basically this is the dinner plate I just put nicely to serve and show you guys this nice, healthy meal I've made today. So the grilled chicken breast, nice steam sauteed bikini, and then I made also some nice steamed basmati rice there. So that's dinner, guys. Hope you all enjoyed. All right, guys, so that is the meal as I showed you, and uh, that is it for tonight. And thank you so much for watching for tonight's recipe. And if you want to know the ingredients that I did for today, it will be under the description box below. So if you haven't subscribed, also please subscribe and also click the icon bell, the, the icon bell button right beside. And every time um, I put in a video, you'll get notified for my next video. All right. Thank you so much for watching, everyone, and have a nice evening.